it's Trisha. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, we're going to be doing another Christmas decorate with me of my kitchen, half bathroom, and my stairway. I hope you guys enjoy these type of videos, and if you do, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. This sign and the next sign I'm going to show you are found in the Target Bullseye Playground. I get most of my decor from there just because it's so affordable. And then the garland is from Walmart. Then this little sleigh, I didn't quite know what to do with it with my decor and I finally, it just came to me like a light bulb that I should put my soap in there and I thought it was so cute. This sign is also from the Target Bullseye spot. as well as this little house from last year, but they have similar ones this year. And I just got the little Reese and glue, hot glue gun it on. All right, now we're moving on to my half bath, and this is just an easy, small place that I enjoy decorating. Okay, so I thought I would take a minute and show you guys what I'm fixing for dinner. This is a casserole. I'm just gonna spray my pan with Pam, and then I'm going to mix up the rice. You can use any kind of white rice you want, just not the instant. You want the, the regular kind that you cook, um, but you don't cook it beforehand. So you're gonna mix up the rice with uh, salsa, cream of chicken, and corn. Mix it in your bowl, then put it in your casserole dish. And then you're gonna lay some chicken breast tenderloins on top of it. You could do chicken breast chunks, whatever you wanna do, just make sure it gets cooked through. And then you're just gonna follow the directions and add some paprika on top. It gives it a little bit more spice and some cheddar cheese at the end. 
It is so delicious. I, of course, I'm not gonna use all of these chicken breast tenderloins. I'm gonna um, bag them up and freeze them for later, but that's what I have right now. This meal is so yummy. My college roommate um, found it when we were in college and we were each cooking once a week and I thought I would share it with you guys because it's super easy and delicious. I'll show it to you once I take it out of the oven too. These bears are one of my favorite holiday traditions that we have. It's not something that I think a lot of people do, but when I was growing up, my mom would buy a bear and each one of them has the year on it for Christmas. And we got them at Kmart and now I think Walmart has them. I haven't checked this year, but usually they have them every year. So we had tons of them growing up and I don't buy them every year now, but we do have like the year we got married and that sort of thing. And it's just very sentimental. And I think they look so cute running up and down the stairs. And now my children have memories of them. And my mom also put them on our stairs. So it's just um, a good family tradition of ours that we have. Let me know below what your family traditions are. our staircase and I love how the garland shows when you come in don't mind my messy living room um, but you can see the tree and these bears are just so special and festive too so here's the view like when you walk in it's a beautiful beautiful Christmas view My tiered tray is from Hobby Lobby, and I did this little hack last year where I hot glued a Target Bullseye Spot wreath onto it, and it just makes it look a little more festive for Christmas. Here is my tiered tray. I used a lot of Ray Dunn in there and then some items from the Target Bullseye Playground and a few ornaments that I already had on hand. I love how it turned out and I just love this plaid tablecloth.
here's what the Tex-Mex chicken casserole looks like out of the oven and I just put some shredded cheese on top and then we're gonna serve it with chips and guac and sour cream. It is so delicious. Let me know if you guys try it.